In this video, I will show you how to use jQuery here to get the text hint box when you hover over a button or input view or picture to get the hint box. So let's look at example. So I have a button. When you hover over this one, you should click to submit the hint box. When I have an input field here, when I hover over this one, it will give you hint, enter your name. So let's look at the source code here. So let's go to this one. So first I design a div. This div with ID, for example, I call it hint box. This is the hint box at the beginning here, there's nothing here. So this one I need to define a CSS because I need to, to give uh, some shape. So this ID, this is the hash here, hint box ID. First I don't want to let it display. I also set the background color, text color, border padding and border radius. I also set it as uh, position absolute. So this is a box shape. So I also have a button here. Button this type is button car is the whole when I use this class this class means whenever the mouse hold over this class, it will have some action here. Similar as the class of input box, I use the hover. And we have another attribute here called hint text. This hint text, I will use jQuery to display this hint text and also this hint text in the hint box. So let's look at this jQuery code. So I have a library here. I directly link to the jQuery code jQuery.com latest jQuery library here. So I use document already. This is means all the JavaScript code is finish loading this all this code here, JavaScript. And I have a hover class here. When a hover class when the whole class mass most over <coughs> most move means most over then have the action function with some e this one. I get the whole text here. This whole text is from this hint text here in the HBO hint text here. How that get this one? I will show this whole text in the hint box. I this hint box, put the text here and show. I also need to put uh, this hint box relation because I uh, input box uh, button is position keep changing. So I need to define a CSS here. Top means CSS probably top. I use the E client Y. This is the most position client Y plus 15 PX. Also e client x. So it's defined to the my text box relation to the this mouse. When the mouse out, I get a hint box height. So when I know mouse over, it will hide this text. So let's run this code. This is the show before. When I click this one, this hint box is related to this mouse position. We mouse rule this uh, top left is 15. Also, this one is saying enter your name. So, in summary, we can use jQuery code, use the mouse move function, and define the hint box here to get the hint box using jQuery. We can have move over the button, move over the input field. We also can move our image the same. Whenever you define the same class, however, this is the class of the hint text.